ain't tryna make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't tryna grow them stunt for you. For the record, live on me going all the way. For the record, ain't tryna link no time to waste. For the record. Good morning, everybody. It's such a gloomy day outside, and I'm watching the Chanel. <laughs> um, anyway, it is really gloomy outside. But what is up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. Thank you for tuning in with me today. I got my glasses on. I hate wearing my glasses on camera because they glare. But this may be a start of a week vlog or weekly vlog. We'll see. If not. This is a weekend vlog, y'all. But uh, today is going to be a very eventful day. I need to get my tripod back on because holding it like this is not not the move. Hold on. There we go. Now we're back in business. So, yeah. I just finished working out, y'all. My goal for this month, because today is July 1st, y'all. And y'all know this is my birthday month. <laughs> so, my goal is to make sure I work out every day all the way up until I leave for my trip. Um, so, yeah. And that's also why I probably possibly be doing weekly vlogs. You know, before I used to do Tylerthon and I up, <laughs> upload every day. It's a hassle. I feel like it's much, I'll probably benefit better off doing weekly vlogs. So, now we're here. So, yeah, me and Jelly, well, Jelly's still asleep, but I'm up. I got up, up early to work out. So, hopefully y'all worked out today. Hopefully drink some water, all of that good stuff because it's hot outside stay hydrated anyway um we're going to see ruby gilman i keep I, before i kept calling that movie ruby tillman i don't i don't know why but i kept doing it but yeah we're going to see ruby gilman this morning and then after that we're heading over to my parents home because my sister is throwing herself a barbecue themed birthday party even though it's gloomy outside and it says it's going to rain it's been saying it's going to rain pretty much this whole entire week but like the time like don't get me wrong it rained but like yesterday for example they were all thunderstorm yada 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 it was literally drizzles <laughs> and then it stopped so it's supposed to rain i guess again today because the way it looked it looked literally like yesterday and we shall see but mainly everything is inside the only thing we was trying to have the kids run around outside but we'll see what the weather do to us but yeah that's the goal for today um yeah, so we're going to go to the movies. I'm going to try not to eat like a crazy person at the movies because we are going to be eating at the um, party. So, yeah, today is not going to be a calorie counting day. I'm just going to have to be very mindful of what I eat. That's the only thing I can do today because <laughs> I'm not counting any calories. You know, when black people cook, we not we not keep a count of what we put in that food. We just let our ancestors lead us the way. So, <laughs> I, I don't know what the calorie count going to be. I'm just going to say approximately... 3,000 <laughs> 3,000 calories gonna be eaten today <laughs> but no that's why I that's why I worked out this morning for sure um my goal actually was to do a hour workout but no no lies a 90 minute 90 minute my goal was to do 90 minutes and I know I already did 50 minutes but I don't think I'm gonna be home in time to do like something else so if I do get home early enough and do another workout I'm gonna do it but I doubt if I'm going to be back home in time to do another workout which just leads me into tomorrow to do my 90 minute workout for sure um but yeah so y'all just gonna follow me along this week i, I really don't know what i got planned i do work <laughs> i do go to school so it's like yeah the, the, that's my life pretty much and i do read y'all i've been reading look i supposed to be getting in the shower <laughs> but let me just tell y'all this real quick i've been reading so much matter of fact this is my ninth book let me show y'all i like to stay in front of my window because that's where the natural light comes in but give me a second this is the book i've been reading the silent patient i've been flipping like through instagram and what they call book talk but i don't have a tiktok so <laughs> it's like i'm on instagram real talks <laughs> So, so yeah i've been looking through there and seeing like recommendations off books of people showing there and then i've also just been like going through the um aisles of target because usually that's where i go get my most of my books um i do want to start ordering some off amazon because some books target do not carry and i do want to go to like a real legit bookstore and actually go through a bookstore and see what books they have there but yeah this is the book i'm reading i literally just started so it ain't that much going on i just learned about the character 
Um, now my book bent on the corner. So yeah, uh, like I said, this is my ninth book. My goal is to read 50 books this year. And I also thought about doing a series of where I like review the books that I've read. But I don't know, y'all let me know. Should I do that? Or let me know if I, if I should. You know what I mean? I'll probably do it anyway. But lately, I've been doing a lot. So it's like, I doubt if I put another thing on my list of things. But if y'all really want me to do it, let your girl know. Or maybe throughout like the vlogs or whatever, I'll just, you know, hit y'all with a quick book review <laughs> instead of doing like a whole segment. So we'll see. Um, because yeah, I also was supposed to have y'all follow me around as I threw out my schooling and I have not been doing that because school been trying to school me so it's kind of just like mm, too much so yeah now we're here <laughs> so let's see and let's hope that you know everything goes accordingly like I said all the kiddos are asleep the kiddos is jelly and bobo so they're sleeping I'm about to take a quick shower get myself looking like a human and yeah let's do this y'all i feel like every time i say what i'm not going to do i end up doing it <laughs> like i'm not going to wear black and i end up wearing black i said today i wasn't going to wear a graphic t-shirt i was going to look like you know whatever whatever and here i am in a graphic t-shirt but it's okay because it's a chill day and who knows i may change when i come back home because we are supposed to go to the movies then come back home and then leave and yada yada because i got it da -da -da -da. <laughs> so it's like yeah but the whole reason i grabbed y'all is because i realized i don't even know where i left off last with my hair update and i'm pretty sure it's not necessarily time for me to do a hair update but y'all just grabbed a piece of my hair and it's just like it's a growing. It's a growing. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I need to wash my hair. It's been a good minute. So yeah. And I need to go get some more contacts. But I know I need to set up the eye doctor from there. I'm not gonna leave the contacts because they're like, girl, you need to come see us. But yeah, that was my whole point of grabbing y'all. I'm still getting ready. <laughs> like, ain't nothing going. I love to put this in my hair. I'm glad I caught myself. I don't know what's going on. But I do want to look semi decent today. Like, I told myself I am so tired of looking tired, and I just need to get back better. I need to have the fitness mentality I had last year, or was that 2020? No, 2021. I think it was 2021. I need to have that mental mentality. I need that mindset I had in January, March, April. March and April, I believe, or April and May. One of those two. I know for sure April, but I don't know if it was March and April or April May. It's one of those M months. I need to have that mentality for my focus that I've been ha was having, and yeah, and then I can get the ball rolling. <laughs> I haven't worn my contacts in so long, and it's driving me crazy. I do need to like definitely get an eye doctor appointment though. Mr. about though. He ready to eat. He's like, girl, I am up and I'm ready. So. I probably not put on any eyeliner now. I was gonna put eyeliner on, but when I go to the movies, I sometimes get sleepy. So I probably just put on eyeliner when I come back and finish getting ready from that point. But yeah, right now I'm just gonna be chilling. I'm gonna put on a wig. Hopefully not a hat, cause I did say I don't wanna wear a hat today. <laughs> so we gonna see. So now, ah! I tripped. So now we're ready. I'm just waiting for the clothes to stop um, washing so I can move it to the dryer. I need to put some lip gloss on my lips. Um, I was going to, I need to put a load of the dishwasher. And yeah, that's pretty much that. Y'all, y'all see my day by day. I feel like every day I'm cleaning up. Every day I'm doing the same thing because yeah, it's just me. It's just me. I, I, I work, I go to school. I gotta come home, take care of the house. I'll be tired, okay? You know, I, there's days I don't wanna do anything. And then there's days I don't do anything. So then everything pile up. So I have to keep moving to the next day. And then when it's the next day, I got all this stuff to do. Moral of the story, I need a maid. <laughs> I need an assistant. <laughs> but no, let me load the dishwasher up. And then hopefully by the time I pick up this camera, then we'll be at the movies because yeah, we gotta get going. Okay, we're back from the movie. Bri, did you like the movie? Yeah. What was your favorite part? Oh wait, don't don't give away the movie. 
You just like the movie, right? Uh huh. Yeah. I like the movie too. It kind of reminded me of a cross between Luca and Turn. Don't run away. Girl, don't try to steal because you heard me tell you. She's trying to steal. <laughs> but you yeah, remind me of a mix between Luca and Turn and Red and Finding Nemo. For, for, you know, all the same movies where the kids being hard head and doing stuff they don't have no business doing and they did it anyway. That, <laughs> mix that with turning red. That's what this movie reminded me of. But yeah, it was a good movie. It was actually, to me, it was, it was alright. It was a cute kids My movie. Favorite. What's your favorite part? Because depending on what you say, I'm going to edit it out. I like when, I, I like when, when. When you call that dog and Bobensky and oh, no. with, with me. Like, yep, I call uh, Ruby and her little pet she had, Bruby. Um, Bruby and Bobensky. But yeah, now we're home. I'm about to do the second half of what we need to do before we head out to the party. So the party's at 4 and it's only 12.14. I actually want to take a quick nap. My goal was to actually go to Sweetwater um, before we leave so I get some caffeine in my system. But your girl thinks she laughed because I feel like I already had enough uh, like drinking of my calories because I had some pop at the movie theater and then we're going to a party where there's also going to be tons of pop and yeah, I think I reached my limit of my intake. <laughs> so I don't know what those crazy kids over there doing. So I think I'm going to just cut it off with, I'm not going to drink any coffee or anything. If anything, probably go there tomorrow morning. We'll see. We'll see how I feel. But, um, but yeah. I'm going to just take like a quick nap. That's all I need to do. Like, what a nap, yeah. All right. Y'all want to see Bobinski before I turn off the camera? Don't mind the vacuum, guys. B. It's Mr. Bin Bin. Hi, Bobo. Say hello. <laughs> he looks so over. He's like, please put me down. Bobo, do, do something cute. <laughs> yeah, do, do something, something cute. cute. <laughs> he said no. Yeah. <laughs> oh, not him rubbing his head on you guys. <laughs> I hope you guys petted him. <laughs> Say bye bye, he Bin Bin. Put his eye on it. No, he, he was rubbing his head on it. Hey, say bye bye, He's getting irritated. Look at his ears. Okay, we're gonna we're done annoying you. Bye, Minsky. We've arrived. Everything is so cute. I'm about to show y'all. I'm about to get y'all some B-roll, but let me put my bag down. Let me go say hey everybody real quick. We don't want to. This is me, Jelly, and my family. Everybody haven't arrived yet. Cause it's still early. I'm about to go put my bag down and then. Yeah, I told you come over and put your stuff in the back.
we finally back home y'all i got so many goodies i did not eat <laughs> so i will be showing y'all a plate tomorrow because like i said i ain't eat today i was on babysitting duty so i pretty much was in the back watching all the kids but i can show y'all what i did grab like a little quick brought home party <laughs> y'all know when people have events and I don't know if this happened at every function, but I know this is very common in the black cu culture. <laughs> in the black and the cultured. We tend to cook and make an order and get more stuff than what we actually need. So then there'd be a lot of things left over, right? So with that being said, let's go through everything. What was that? Oh, my camera fell. I'm glad it fell that way and not towards the floor. Ugh. I got tons of soda, which I shouldn't be owning any pop. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I don't. I shouldn't be owning any pop, cause you know your girl on the fitness journey. This is not good. <laughs> but I mean, we can just treat ourselves. Not bubble in the bag. Say hi, baby boy. Say hi, poo poo. Hi, baby poo poo poo. Okay, excuse me. But yeah. More of the story. I got some drinky drinks, you know. Just treat myself here and there. <laughs> we got some water too. And this is kind of good because those days, those days when me and Jelly go out and I don't want to bring like a big water bottle, I could um just bring those. Y'all already saw these. Brought some of these. Um, what else? What else? I got some cupcakes, which y'all saw those already. But I brought some home. And then, that's everything for this bag. Hold on. <laughs> Bubba looking like, what is going on? I gotta put all this stuff in the refrigerator. Got some more drinks. <laughs> Some more drinks i got some corn on the cob even though i can't even eat it but i'm gonna like cut it up cut me some up and then jelly can eat the whole corn, corn on the cob but i'm gonna cut me some up and make some elote that's what i'm excited about <laughs> i'm mad i'm actually giving y'all a haul of what i always stuff i got this is ridiculous i got some leftover hawaiian bread because <laughs> jelly loves this bread i got some buns for my hamburger and Bre Bre Bree's hot dogs. What else? Some more corn. Um, some chips. <laughs> um, oh, I hope our cake didn't get smushed. What is this? I think this is our cake. This is our hot dogs in my Impossible Burger. Oh, excuse me. Oh yeah, potato salad and pasta salad. That's what this is. And it can't get a little smush, but it's okay. It's still edible. I'm trying to show y'all, but y'all really can't see it because how smush it got. It looks like potato cake now. That's the potato. <laughs> I'll show y'all better tomorrow when I eat some for lunch. Um, and then the pasta salad, which is crazy because I actually want to make me some pasta salad not too long ago so this is really good but i got some and yeah that's it just a lot of drinks some snacks and some sweets and yeah but like i said i didn't really eat today because i was still kind of full from the movie theater and everything we ate there the only thing i literally ate well it wasn't really ate the only thing i had at my parents home oh lies i had a bag of cheetos and a pepsi that was pretty much it and a cupcake i think two cupcakes because <laughs> I had a vanilla and a chocolate other than that I had nothing else and I was just chilling drinking water and that was that that was pretty much it so now I'm about to put all this stuff away and then I'll see y'all tomorrow cuz excuse me your girl's tired I tried to get some footage here and there at the party but I was on baby duty so I was just keeping track of the kiddos and stuff so that's pretty much that but tomorrow it's just gonna be a more chill day um like i said i made my to-do list of what i'm gonna do tomorrow honestly i'll probably film a video tomorrow too 
we'll see how everything goes but um yeah let me put all this stuff away and then i will see you all tomorrow on day two july 2nd could y'all believe this we in july time is flying baby good morning everyone i'm whispering because first my voice feel like it's gone secondly everyone is still asleep except for me i will still have the audacity to get up at my normal time rude i know but y'all hear the rain I was just sitting here reading my book and I was just like, I heard it start pouring and I was just like, what is going on? <laughs> but I'm about to sit back down and relax because I'm still tired. Um, I think it's like 7 something, 7.40. And yeah, you know, you know, my goal was to get up like about 9 o'clock. <laughs> so I'm about to lay back down, finish reading my book and maybe watch a show and then get started on my to-do list that i have today but yeah guys my eyes burn i need to go to the eye doctor that's on my list do i have something on my face because i know last time in one of my videos i woke up and didn't even know i had stuff stuck in the corner of my mouth gross <laughs> but yeah i'm about to um finish relaxing it did yeah get my day started i just want to do a, a morning and let y'all hear the rain. Oh, speaking of which, I should record this for I'm doing things behind the scene, okay? I'm not talking about it until it's done. <laughs> Okay, so I just finished clean, I mean cleaning, I just finished um, reading my book for an hour. That was my goal this morning. It's getting good. I'm on part two, as y'all see. This one is kind of different from other books that I read. I'm looking for some shorts. <laughs> I'm looking for some shorts to put on, y'all. Um, it's different from other books I read because it's reading from someone else's perspective versus the main person that the story is about, you know. I don't want to say third person because it's not speaking to third person. It's like, like I have read books where everybody like, okay, how can I explain this? <laughs> how can I explain this to make it make sense? Because I'm probably making it make sense now and I'm confusing myself trying to make it make sense for y'all when it already makes sense. Anyway, but y'all know how there's the first person point of view or whatever and you're reading it off someone else's thing or whatever, right? So... <laughs> I read stories like that and then I read stories where it's kind of like you're seeing everyone's viewpoint of the same situation type of thing but you're getting everyone else's viewpoint versus someone telling you that this is their per that person's viewpoint follow me camera follow me <laughs> but this one is like it's somebody telling someone else's story type of thing but it's still his story but you're just listening to him talk about someone else's story did I make sense? <laughs> I doubt. I don't think I did. But nonetheless, the story got me very intrigued. I'm not going to lie. Um, I, I'm actually curious to see what happened. I actually want to re get through part two tonight after I'm done doing everything I have to do. I am. My goal today is to wash my hair, clean the bathrooms, and do my schoolwork. So that's my goal for today. Those are like my top threes. Anything else I do today is extra, aside from exercising. I would like to exercise, even though I'm kind of sore. But we're going to see as the day go what I do. Um, I'm not really hungry. As y'all saw in the video, I was drinking some ginger tea. Because I just wanted to, like, push everything along. <laughs> TMI, but you know. Like, yesterday I really didn't eat much. But the things that I did eat was very heavy. It was a lot of bread. It was a lot of bread so i kind of woke up in the mindset today of like i kind of want to do a fast but then i'm just like um i thought something stuck on my lip i knew something stuck on my lip hopefully that wasn't on my lip while i was recording but um i kind of woke up today and wanted to do a fast like i did last time when i just and prop two did a fast but we'll see because all i had so far was some um tea uh, I do need to drink some water. Okay, so I created a whole new game plan and a whole mess of me grabbing my stuff. What I decide I'm going to do, because this makes more sense, I am going to do a quick workout, take a shower, wash my hair, 
then I'm going to clean <laughs> and then I'm going to do my schoolwork and then I'm going to relax that sound makes more sense because me cleaning the bathroom does in the shower to wash my hair and who knows how much hair it's going to get detangled out of my little fro so yeah I just decided we're going to do it that way that makes more sense and I will be more happy <laughs> if I did it that way so yeah let me exercise do the whole game plan I just said and yeah now we have to get in together we have to get in order now just finished my workout the workout was really nice I liked it it was really chill and I liked that the women weren't all skinny or whatever they were just at all different body types that was a pop sugar workout um yeah I'll pop sugar on YouTube to search it <laughs> But yeah, I've been trying to do different workouts just to switch it up, just to give my body some different, you know, things. I've been doing dancing, I've been doing kickboxing, cardio, strength training. I've been all over the place on YouTube. YouTube is my free gym. I do need to purchase some more weights, but other than that, I know I don't have time for a gym membership, so that's why I stick to my YouTube. I do be tempted, I do be like, oh, I should get a gym membership, but then I remember, I don't got time for that. <laughs> I don't. I'm not going to waste money. I had a gym membership before and I literally was just paying for that place to stay open because I was not showing up. So I canceled it once I came to my senses. So, yeah, now I'm just a home workouter, outside workouter. Um, I'll be a guest at someone's gym. If y'all want to invite me to the gym and I'll be your guest, I'm cool with that. But me paying for the gym, out of the question because I know I'm not going to show up. Um, but anyway, y'all hear my shower running. I'm about to get in the shower, wash my hair, and all that stuff. Y'all already know I ran it down, so let's get to it. So I already showed y'all the products I'm using with my hair. I use this on like the outline of my hair, my edges in the back, the, na the nape, is that what that's called? <laughs> and like just above the ear and all that. I use that for my perimeter of my hair. Then I use the Mayel Rosemary Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil for my scalp. And then y'all gonna hear Bobo at the door because he's trying to come in and I told him no. <laughs> um, and then I got the Cantu Leave-In Conditioner. I'm honestly just trying to get rid of this because I have another jar of this. But I do have other leave-in conditioners that I do want to use. I just want to get rid of this one because uh, not him opening the door. Not you fighting the strength to open up my door. You better behave. And don't you knock none down. And don't you hop on the sink. Okay. So, yeah, that's pretty much that. And, of course, I got my blue wide tooth comb. I did plenty of um, videos on my channel with me washing my hair doing all of that. So I didn't really need to necessarily show y'all. My curls are popping though. I can't say that. Uh, like I said, my hair is a growing. I am on my sixth month. Am I? I think it is the sixth month. I did cut my hair in December of the 28th. December of the 28th. December 28th. January, March, May, June. Yeah, six months. So I'm six months post big chop. It feel like my hair hasn't grown since the last time but I planned it on myself because I slacked again on my hair routine so hopefully by me doing these weekly um, vlogs and staying on my schedule that I get back on track so yeah my hair needed a really good tender love and care and that's why we're here uh, but surprisingly I didn't have a lot of um <laughs> what's this called I didn't have a lot of uh, uh I like to call it dead hair, where like when you're detangling it, it's like, this is what came out of the comb. And then of course, some got washed out down the sink that I couldn't catch, so, I mean not down the sink, down the um, drain when I was showering. So yeah, now we're here, but my hair feels very clean, fresh, and ready to get some love. So let me hurry up and do what I gotta do. Perimeter me. I don't know if I told y'all what this is castor oil <laughs> like i feel like i just lifted it up instead i put this on my perimeter never told y'all what it was so it's the jamaican tropic isle living jamaican black castor oil 
for growth and anyone who knows or been on my channel a lot since i gave birth to jelly i just had this ball spot just right here in my hair that i've been just trying to grow back and it's been very unsuccessful so let me just massage that in and i don't really part my hair don't you even think about it oh no you're not i know you laugh i know you laugh uh-uh see this is why you couldn't come in because you do too much that now i'm closing my door all the way I'm gonna show y'all what he did when I'm done. <laughs> a mother of two, I cannot take this. Massage everything as one. Mm. I like the Mayo, how it's just like that tingly. It's not like a burning tingly, but it's just like a refreshing tingly on your scalp when it's all clean. Ooh, <laughs> ooh. <laughs> anyway, let me put this in my hair and then let me, um. I'm gonna let my hair air dry, but I'm just making me a plate and I'm gonna show y'all my plate. I think I got too much on my hand. I, I definitely did. Tyler, you don't got that much hair. What are you, what are you doing? Just remember, I said I was gonna show y'all what he did to my tissue. You see that? The tissue was not in his business. And he's just gonna hop up and attack it. The ghetto. Ta da! I got my Impossible Barbecue Burger. Some potato salad when I add some more paprika on top and some pasta salad. Okay, y'all, I'm done cleaning both of my bathrooms. So that video should be up already. If y'all, um, by the time y'all see this, that video is already up. Hopefully, you already viewed it. I like cleaning videos, but just cleaning two bathrooms is tiring. And cleaning the whole house at one time is tiring. <laughs> Good morning. It's Monday. All right, it's a quick check in. I'm about to be sneezing a lot because I took my medicine late for Bobinski. Now I'm just sneezing. Um, <laughs> excuse me. As y'all can see, in my background, <laughs> I am in the middle of deep cleaning my kitchen. So I just took everything out of here. I'm about to take everything out of there next. I'm cleaning it and I'm about to rearrange it. I also got dishes that I need to put in the dishwasher. I'm washing these by hand, ignore that. But those are going in the dishwasher. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to get everything organized. So I can see and I'm watching the idol. A lot of people was judging the show, so I was like, why not? Let me get in on the judgment. Um Honestly, I, I don't I don't know <laughs> what's all the hate about, what all the rigmarole and the words of Berlizzi. I don't know what's going on. Um like why everybody hate it. Like I don't know. I feel like I'm probably the person that likes all the HBO. No, not all, because I didn't see all of their shows, but like Velma, everybody was judging that show now. I, I like the show. <laughs> like, I, I didn't see anything wrong with that. I actually can't wait for it to come back. But um, yeah, everyone was hating on this show. So I was just like, let me see what it's, what it's all about. Cause I don't know. We're gonna see. So I've been watching it. I'm on episode three. Um, Yeah, it just feels like to me, any typical show, to be honest with you. I don't know. And why is everybody cringing? I don't understand, you know? <laughs> Why is everybody finding it weird? I don't know, it's because it's the weekend and I don't recall ever seeing him in anything else acting wise. Um, and the other girl, like the lead girl who played Jocelyn, I thought she was Anne Sophia Ro Rob, Rope. I don't, I, I don't know how she pronounced her last name. But yeah, I thought that was a girl, that her. But it's not her, <laughs> allegedly. I, I really didn't look and I really didn't pay attention to the credits. So, I can't sit there and say it isn't, but I don't think it's her. I don't think it's her. But she does look like they could be related low-key. So, yeah, that's just what I'm doing right now. Jelly just left with my parents. They picked her up for me. So, yeah. Your girl's just about to be cleaning. I would do a montage of me cleaning the kitchen. And I was going to do like a separate video of me deep cleaning my kitchen. But... Seeing that I have a lot to do, I don't know. <laughs> like maybe I will probably do the rest of the deep cleaning on video, but right now me organizing and cleaning up the cabinets, I think I'm just gonna let that be me doing it on my own because of like so much that I have to go through. And I, I don't want to be editing um, a super long video. Yeah, this will be nice footage, but your girl got a lot to go through. So yeah, and today's my sister's birthday. So, even though we celebrated on Saturday, her actual real birthday is today. So, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. Okay, I'm just rambling now. Let me get up out of here. Let me finish cleaning because I do want to be on my time schedule of everything being done.
y'all i just got done filming my nail haul i was gonna give it away but i'm gonna let y'all wait well y'all probably seen it already <laughs> i forgot this is a weekly vlog y'all saw already my pretty in pink um nail haul um i need to start wearing my press on if i'm gonna be honest with y'all i keep buying press ons and i'm not wearing them so i think that's gonna be on my self-care this sunday to actually put on some press on nails and just get cute so y'all <laughs> don't mind my face i, I was being hard-headed and popped the pimple but it is july 12th guys <laughs> Okay, tell us what's going on. Like this. Go ahead. Today is the alarm sounding. That means it's that means it's a tornado coming. It's a tornado warning right now. It's a tornado warning. <laughs> yes, as y'all can see. And yes, my news on the computer there. And y'all can hear the siren. Yeah. You hear the siren? So yeah. That's what's going on with us today. <sighs> Y'all, I was just about to take a beautiful bath. There was a perfect temperature. I've been talking about this bath all day. Right? Yeah, at least we're together and safe. And if you guys wonder where Bobinski is, he's in his cage for now. He's taking a nap. But I do have his <laughs> bag ready if we have to exit. And we got our clothes on just in case we got to exit. So, yeah, right now we're watching and, you know, I'm looking at people on their balconies, looking oh, up at the sky and recording, and I'm just like, Can I say something? Oh, that? and I moved Bobinski to pet carry away from the window. Yeah. But, yeah, that's what's going on today. Yes. So, I don't know if y'all want to see this clip, <laughs> but that's what's going on today. I don't, I don't want to record too much because I want to focus, but yes, yeah, serious things happen. I'm so mad. I should have been touching my face because now look at all these votes. This didn't start happening until I started using Curology, and I stopped using it at this point because it wasn't doing nothing for my face. But um, notice now that anytime I have like a pimple and I touch it, or even when I get my eyebrows arched, it like puffs up like that. So it's like I, I don't know what they did to my face. Lawsuit? I'm joking, but yeah, <laughs> I don't know what they did to my face. So yeah, what's up, girlfriend? Um, um, my my purple thing is dripping, and I don't know why. Cause you're a slobber. Do you know what you do in a tornado drill? You hide. Huh? What do you do first? Stop. Well, that's a fire drill. What you do in a tornado drill? Stay away from windows? Stay away from windows? Go into bathrooms? Yeah, you go to a covered room or go down below. Remember the stairwell? You can go there. Or, or the exit sign? Yeah, follow the exit sign and what you don't take. Or, or don't take what? Don't take the elevator. Right. You gotta, even though it's an emergency, you gotta save that for people who need the elevators. Because there's some people who can't take the stairs. And if it does allow fire drill, that means you need to hide somewhere. A fire drill? What's she talking about? Anyway, alrighty guys. I mean, I mean, uh, a tornado drill. Yeah. Okay, I hope everyone is safe. By the time you guys see it, it's going to be late. And I hope everyone was home safe. And if you weren't, didn't make it home, I hope you were able to get shelter wherever you could have. And yeah. Yeah, goodbye. Or in mail, or in stores that are open. Yeah. Ew, you fogging up my camera. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I meant by take shelter, Brie But okay, this is going on long enough. Peace, guys. Okay, y'all. I cannot wait to get my hair done. I'm tired of getting on this camera looking like a who done it and what for. Jelly and I about to head to the Nature Fest. We're late, but it's our at three. But it's okay. Nonetheless, we're arriving. We actually want to take a, um, a lift there so we don't have to be dealing with, you know, outside like that for real so <laughs> we about to hurry up and leave and see y'all when we get there
Okay guys, so I just finished washing my hair. I'm doing my whole self care Sunday thing. And y'all, my day did not go accordingly. We were supposed to have a beach day yesterday. And then the weather was um, talking about it's gonna rain, which it did not rain. <laughs> well, my sister said it rained where she was, but it didn't rain where we were. And then it said it was gonna be good today. But then when I checked the weather app, they were talking about how their air quality isn't good. So that is, this is pretty much the end of the video. You like my little fro. This is the end of the video. You guys have two weeks, even though it's supposed to be been a weekly vlog. So don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to thumbs up the video if you like it. And yeah, come back. What are you getting up for? And if you hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you can make sure you come back to see me and see and catch up and see what's going what about on. me? And see Ambriella. She really so badly want to be on this camera. Say bye hi. Bye bye everyone. <laughs> no, you're supposed hi. to be saying hi. There hi. you go. Hi. Okay. Last time mommy made pie. And when did I make pie? That pie. That's cornbread. Mm, see, that's why you don't need to be on camera. <laughs> Telling lies. <laughs> False information. Mommy made a cornbread and it was really good. And it got so, sugar what? in it. And what? then what? mommy is the best cook. She's going to get a golden chef from me. Thank you. But why are you so loud? Bye bye, world. <laughs> exactly. Girl. <laughs> Girl. Bye bye, Wolf. Wait. Y'all, she said I'm a good cook, considering I don't cook. <laughs> oh, girl, be careful, considering I don't like to cook. You okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, put this pen down, because while you was falling, they could have poked you in your eye. <sighs> Children. I'm okay. Children, I tell you. But yeah, she, cut, she said I'm a good cook. All right. Bye, guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. Duty. <laughs> Blow kisses. <laughs> Gently. Go at the same time. Oh, that is not gentle. That is a boom. There we go. I'm a shine shit. I've been really getting a feel. You know why I'm here. Don't act like you don't know how I feel. But let me tell you what you mean to me. Slide on me for that mean greed.